Hi guys, this is Karen. Welcome to another exciting video and another haul. Unfortunately, the box just is so plain and there's nothing to see. So let's see from where did I get this package. Let's take the knife and see. For the first time, in, well, I already know from where I got this package. Yeah, I do, but you don't. Or, yeah, we already know, you saw the title of the video. Okay. But let's see what I got inside. This is nice. There's the UPS here. And we have two boxes in the same box. Both from Ruffer. This is so exciting. Okay, let's see what I got. Let's open the big package first. And we'll see what we have inside this big package. Of course, it's torture to open. I don't know why that, that's so hard to open here. See this? Let's open it also from the other side. I don't ruin the package. Why are they do keep doing this to me? Okay, now I put it inside and it doesn't want to come out. Yeah, okay, now of course I had to ruin the package. But let's see what I have is. Oh yeah, I remember. Okay, let's get it out. Okay. This is from my first ever order from Ruffer. Never ordered from them before. Oh, this is so beautiful. It feels so luxurious. Oh, it's just two boxes. I thought I was ordering something else. Okay, so they're stackable. Okay, is there anything else here? Okay, no, we have just... Oh, I got component A, which is two boxes. I was sure that I ordered component B. Hmm, just said Vanity component, but Vanity USA, US-A, so probably, yeah. Okay, so I got <laughs> probably a mistake by my side, but I was so excited to order for the first time from Refer. So I got component A, which is just two cute boxes. Oh, they're magnetized. Oh, this is perfect. Okay, no, nothing happened. But these are magnetized, which is perfect. Yep, definitely going to use them. This is just gorgeous. Let's put this aside. And let's see what we have here in the second box. Handcrafted in Japan. That's what it says here. Ooh, and these are the brushes that I ordered. I ordered four brushes from Ruffer and they have arrived. Now, I heard so many good things about Ruffer's quality and their brushes, and I really wanted to try for the first time, and they had a Black Friday sale, 50% off, so, and free shipping. So it was 50% off and free shipping, so why the hell not? So I got three. Let's see which ones I got. Okay, I got this one, which is 16. Unfortunately, there is no brochure here. And I don't remember which one do, does what. This is zero two. Why am I holding it like that? This is number two. This is like how it looks like. Oh, it's so comfortable. Okay, next. Up is let's see, this is number five. This is a face palette. A face palette. <laughs> okay, this 
This is so soft. Oh my god. The last one is this one. Let's see which number is this. This is number 14. This is a cute brush. Now there is no explanation here. I would have thought that they would be. So let's check their website and see which brush does what. I mean, if there is no explanation, then let's go to the website. So this is refer brushes made in Japan. And let's see. Oh, here are the modular vanity sets. Okay. And this is beautiful, but this is not what I'm looking for. Oh, uh, okay. Let's see. Okay, so I have number five. Yeah, this is number five. Okay, so number five, an ultra soft cheek brush that will instantly elevate your face makeup in a luxurious way. This flagship cheek brush has been a community favorite since its debut, debuté, and is designed for blush, powder, highlight, and bronzer applications. Handmade in Kumanu, Japan by master artisan using uncut natural hair. Bristle length 38 millimeters. Okay, so this is number 05. Let's see what else I have here. Well, where are all their brushes? Maybe they're just showing the ones that are in stock? I don't know. Okay, so 02 is a versatile high-density shader that will pack on shadow like no other. Okay, but I don't have anything here about 14 and 16. It's like if they're not on stock that they do not appear on the website. I don't know. I don't get that. It's very strange. Yeah, but this is it. If they're not selling it, you can't really see what the brush does. I don't get that. I don't understand. Concept store, maybe? Oh, here is brush number 5. 30, 31, 21. But where are all of my brushes? This is frustrating. Okay, now 30, 31, 21. I don't see all the other brushes. I guess I'm missing something. Oh, there's a search. Okay, let's look for brush number 16. Okay, now we're talking. Brush 16, this is the one. A large tapered crease brush that ideal for applying a quick wash of base color on leads. Due to its Tempered shape and soft bristles, brush 16 is also a pro favorite for detailed highlighting. Okay, now let's look for brush. And I have the last one, 14. Brush 14, which is this one, is a small crease brush Specially designed for the hooded eye, slightly tapered at the tip, this brush is structured enough to lay down color, yet fluffy enough to blend and diffuse with ease. The shape of brush 14 has been carefully calibrated to work with all eye shapes and excels with the hooded eye. 
Okay, so now we know after a very long time and after a very long search what these brushes do. So I got four just to try. So I took one face and three for the eyes and I got these two vanities that Ooh, well, they are modular because they do stick to one another, which is just perfect. So do check out their website. Um, and you can go to search and, like I did, and look for information about each brush. Well, I hope that was helpful for you. Of course, I will have to wash them and try them and see what I think about them. Are they worth the money? Because, you know, they are basically very expensive. Now I just bought them at 50% off, but usually they are very expensive. So, what do we think about these brushes? What do I think about these brushes? I know that online, on YouTube, everybody is raving about them. But now I can test for myself and see what I think about them. If you're cu curious to know, then stick around on my channel. We will find out together. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, sit, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I'm uploading a new video. And with that said, and with this beautiful creature here, I will leave you and I will catch you all in my next video. Bye!